Hi there. So today I wanted to do an unboxing of my new uh, Louis Vuitton um, Pochette Felici. And I wanted to do this because I really scoured the YouTube and the internet for um, different unboxing review videos before I purchased this. And just to kind of back up as to why I purchased this, um, I really was looking for a small bag that would be secure um, that I could use in conjunction with a diaper bag. So I'm about to have my fourth child. I'm 36 weeks pregnant. He can, I'm like ready to evict him. Um, but I wanted something that I could use still for me and my stuff. Um, that still looked nice and I felt good about. Um, but then also if I wanted to tuck it in the diaper bag, I could and my stuff wouldn't fall out. Um, and would just hold the essentials, keys, you know, cards, um, lip gloss, you know, just again, my stuff come, you know, in one small bag. So I do have a favorite. Um, I do also have a Speedy B30, um, which I love. I have a Pachette Matisse, which I love, but again, those were kind of all a little bit bigger than the footprint I was looking for this bag to have. Oh, I should say I'm the most um, indecisive person probably out there. So I did order both um, this Pochette Felici in um, Monogram and Damier Bin because I, I totally butchered that, I'm sure, but because I couldn't decide on the print. Um, and so when they came, I did kind of decide that I wanted to keep the Damier Bin. I just liked the way the bag looked um, better in the print. Um, and I thought, I would have been monogram all the way. Um, I was stalking the website for that. So totally thought that that's what I was gonna go for. And so I was surprised when both came and I liked the bag better in the Damier Ben print. So, um, you know, as you can see, actually I started already, but as you can see, it comes with this dust bag. And of course it came with all the paperwork. I've already just opened that. And then you can see here's the bag. So um, this one has the checkered, Damier Ben checkered print, has the D rings on the side, has the gold button. When you open it, it has this really pretty red lining, which I also thought I was gonna prefer the lining in the inserts of the monogram um, because it was in the purple-ish fuchsia. Um, but I was pleasantly surprised that in person, this was darker, uh, the lining. I don't know. It just, it's more of like a classic red to me. It wasn't as bright as I thought this was going to be. And you can see that this also comes with two inserts, which I think is a really, I mean, I, I don't want to say a value because it's still a pricey bag, but um, the fact that it comes with these other items, I love SLGs. I love small other goods to keep my things organized so I can find them. So I thought that these would be useful. I originally wanted the monogram because I thought that the fuchsia would, I would use more in other bags. But again, this it isn't really coming off as rich of a red, I don't think, as it does in person. So I do think that I will use these in other bags also. So this comes with a zippered pouch. Um, which I have, I plan to keep like a lip gloss in, a small hand cream in. And then this uh, card holder has eight card slots and then also room for bills, which I don't really carry a lot of cash, but I try to just keep like five bucks on me or something. And then, you know, some basic cards. And then the inside of the bag, you can see, you know, has this, it is a structured bag. There's the chain, which is beautiful. I like in weight. It's really nice and heavy, very pretty. I could see myself also using this on the favorite if I wanted to dress that up. Um, and I needed something slightly bigger. Um, and you can see the large pocket here. And then also has a slit pocket in the back. Um, so I checked, you know, my phone does fit in the back here, which is nice. And then I do plan to use these with with the bag. So again, I'm gonna keep a lip gloss hand cream in here. And then I'm gonna keep my cards $5 in here. And then my iPhone 11. 
will also fit in here also. And I could probably put a couple antibacterial wipes in here given the COVID-19 climate and such. Um, so again, I, I like the, this chain. I will say that I was worried about this being too dressy for me. Um, I'm a mom of going to be four soon and you know, I'm going to spend the summer home with my kids just given the current climate with COVID-19. Um, but I don't think that this looks too dressy. I, that was really my worry. And I really don't think that it does. I think that it looks really cute on. Um, and again, I also like the fact that I could just tuck the chain in and then, um, use this in a bigger bag if I wanted to. So, you know, down the road, if I'm traveling for work, I can put this in my Neverfull and have this or wear it close to my body if I'm traveling in an airport. Or I also, again, can just wear this as a grab and go item. Um, I'm not afraid of the chain. The chain is really a beautiful, beautiful, heavy duty chain. So, you know, I was worried about having to be delicate with it. It's really heavy. I don't, I don't have any worries about that. Um, if you'd like to see what fits in here, I'm happy to do a video on that. Um, but I just wanted to kind of do a quick unboxing, show you what I, I received. Um, I did have to stock the website for about two weeks to get this bag. Um, so, you know, created a profile and refresh, refresh, refresh whenever I was looking at my phone. So I'm really, really happy with, with this bag. Um, this is, again, is the Pochette Felici. Um, if anybody is interested, again, in kind of what fits in here and more mod shots, even on a pregnant belly, I'm happy to show those. So just drop some comments and I'm happy to, um, you know, make some subsequent uh, videos for this as well. Thank you so much for watching. Take care.